For our announcements this week, I encourage you to read the email that was sent by our office administrator, Katie Vinheisen. That email contains a long list of prayer requests. Several families in our church have recently tested positive for the coronavirus. One family uh, tragically lost a loved one to this virus. At the same time, another family was able to welcome a, a loved one home from the hospital. So there's both bad news and good news, and there's also cause uh, to continue pr causes to continue praying for. So uh, I encourage you to read that email and to be faithful and persistent in lifting those individuals and those families up in prayer. In the announcement email, we also learn that uh, we are updating our directory for 2021. If you would like to send in a more recent photo of your family, please feel free to do so. We receive a, a thank you letter from the San Fernando Valley Rescue Mission. In that uh, email, And we also uh, have word from our deacons that the following causes have been designated for this month of January. Uh, they encourage us to consider supporting Bethel's Benevolence Fund, our ministry shares, Rachel Beveridge, our missionary in Guatemala, and the Back to God Hour. If you would like to support those causes, please consider uh, writing those names on the envelope or the check that you send in. All right, I'd like to now invite you to enter a time of prayer. We're going to listen to a song together, and I encourage you to mention some of these requests in your prayers, but also to incorporate your own needs and the needs of your family, as we all now Come before our Father in prayer.